Well, I'll tell you the inspiration for the Up Close series was Leonard Bernstein's preview concerts. And what he would do is on a Thursday night, he would have the Carnegie Hall full and he would rehearse the orchestra. And as he would coach them, he turned up and he'd explain what he was doing. And he would involve the audience in their process and fly. <laughs> A little out of control. Bum, bum. Fall apart a little. Bum, 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 bum. Beautiful. Nice and easy. Music is so familiar in some places, Cameron. Cameron just said he'd written Prodigal Son and he'd written Romeo and he stole from both, uh, Mr. Prokofiev. Uh, it's so interesting to be able to work with a musician like Cameron to get to ask him the questions about the music. Oh, my hair. Oh, I do like these shoes. Oh, I do think I'll wear these tonight. Yes. Oh, I love that. Whoa. How can a foot be the personification of grief? You know, the foot, when, um, when you watch the tapes, they like have this whole communication to the floor. And Janet was saying that it's like when you watch a baby and they're kind of like this. And it's that position, but it's the grief. Dance it out, Tyler. And Joe, you just keep with her. Here we go. Now a little pluck. It's so light. Good. Oh, much better. Ah. Wow. Beautiful. As you can see he's moving in ways that are quite unfamiliar, and what's interesting is that there's a Robbins ballet that uses this as well. So I think it's probably kind of confusing the whole thing. Right? Yeah. The whole thing is a little, a little different. That's right. The no one shares, and if my life is like the day. I prefer not to fly 